Phil Spencer, the head of Xbox, has got some big news for Nintendo gamers. Here it is on Reddit, but here's, here's an actual tweet. Microsoft entered to a 10-year commitment to bring Call of Duty to Nintendo following the merger of Microsoft and Activision Blizzard King. They're committed to helping bring more games to more people, however they choose to play. He also says that Microsoft's committed to continue to offer Call of Duty on Steam simultaneously at Xbox after we have closed the merger with Activision Blizzard King. This is great news for you know, Nintendo gamers, now, they didn't specify Switch, or not. I don't think it'll really come to the Switch, at least, unless they're doing just a straight-up cloud version. I mean, of course, it wouldn't be the older older games, I guess the 360 versions or whatever. They, they could do that if they want. I'm not sure if they will. It's hard to say. Uh, maybe it'll come out on the next Nintendo system, Switch 2, or whatever they decide to call it. And we'll see. But anyway, but... uh. This is just this is just great news. Somewhat of a shot, I guess, if you want to call it. It's not not really a shot, but it kind of is at Sony, who's publicly been talking about how they don't want this deal to go through for Activision Blizzard King, you know, Microsoft acquiring them and everything, about how it'll change the landscape, it'll be unfair, it'll be monopolistic, all that kind of stuff. I, you know, I don't I don't know about all that. So, I mean, you know, we'll, we'll see, I suppose. I mean, but at the same time, if Microsoft's, you know, They've, they've offered, supposedly, this same 10-year commitment to, to Sony to bring Call of Duty out and everything. But, I, you know, then you start talking about business stuff where it's like, well, are the, are the results favorable or the terms favorable? I guess I should say. You know, well, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. But to me, it's just, is this is big news that it's coming to Nintendo and Nintendo systems. We'll see what systems. We'll see what games it is. But it's just, you know, more games for more people. That's always a good thing, in my opinion. Uh, I'll go ahead and link this stuff in the description box if you want to read it. There's not a whole lot to it. I mean, you can read the comments and stuff. And most of them are pretty favorable on both Reddit and on uh, Twitter, as you would expect. I mean, who's going to have a major problem with this kind of stuff? There, there's some console war stuff where people start bashing Sony. And it's like, eh, you know, eh, I, I don't really get into too much of that stuff because I don't really care what box wins or whatever. But anyway, whatever. Point is, I'll link all this stuff in the description box. Thank you very much for watching and have a good one.